All right, so today we are gonna be taking on the newest Super Bad Earth stage on Global, which is stage 55, Androids slash Cell Saga only. Now, a quick reminder to go check out Gamer Subs in my description down below for waifu shakers like this one, as well as their shirts, supplements, and all that good stuff. Now, unfortunately, this specific waifu shaker has been sold out for quite some time now, but they're coming out with some very exciting new drops in the near future, so definitely keep an eye out for that. And as always, you can use my discount code TIGER for 10% off everything. Okay, so with that said, let's jump right into it here. And as you can see, we're using an Android slash Cell Saga team featuring the double AGL Trunkses, Fizz LR Cell and Cell Juniors, Int LR Cell Tech Androids, uh, Fizz LR Trunks, and finally the STR Second Form Cell. And on this first rotation, we have the double LR cells, which is exactly what I wanted. And um, let's start by... I mean, given their defense, I kind of feel like we don't need to use an item. But I also know that fights with only two enemies do hit really, really hard. So just to be safe, let's pop the Icarus. There we go. And... Uh, even though the Int LR Cell has more defense, there are so many King Cold attacks in the first slot that I'm going to leave the Fizz Cell where he is. Uh, let's just give him one orb for the attack all, and that's going to be an 18 key super. Oh, damn. Okay, I thought we would be able to get an 18 key super for the Int Cell, but I guess not. And uh, can we get a super for the trunks? We cannot. Okay, so a bit of a weird rotation aside from the two cells together. But that's fine. That's fine. Okay, a super here is going to do... Oh my god. <laughs> a lot more than I thought. A lot more than I thought. So, the Icarus was definitely a good call. No question about that. If I didn't use the Icarus... Uh, we would have taken, I think, 400k, and even though we would have survived that, it would have been really, really bad. Like, really, really bad. Additional super for the trunks is great, just in case the, just in case the Frieza decides to super us. Um, I'm a little bit worried right now, I'm not gonna lie. No super there. Perfect. We got lucky, man. We got lucky, because if Cell had supered us there, uh, or rather, if the Frieza had supered us there, I think we would have been screwed. I really do. Okay, so we got the double Trunks rotation this turn. Um, I kind of feel bad about not giving the tech orbs to the androids since they created them, but I want to keep the Trunkses together, so I guess... We'll just uh, put the Fizz Trunks in the first slot. Let's uh, go for... You know what? Let's just finish off the Frieza because he's so close. And then we can get a super... Oh, this actually works out well. Okay, I'll give these to the Trunks. And then we can save the Tech Orbs actually for the Androids. But before that, let's uh, heal up a bit. I'm going to go for an Aider because I am fully aware of how hard these guys hit now, so I don't want to risk it. And uh, the Fizz LR Trunks will definitely finish the Frieza. Guaranteed crit as well against Wicked Bloodline. There's an additional super. And the Androids might actually not get to attack at all. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the AGL Trunks will super at least twice, and that should actually kill the King Cold. Yep. There we go. Oh, wow. One super was enough, actually. <laughs> Just the one super. Okay, moving on. Moving on. Fight number two. I believe it's 19 and Jero. I was right. 19 and Jero. And since it's also another two-person fight, I'm going to go for the Whis this time. And... Uh, let's see. Uh, let's put the Int Cell in front this time. Um, 18 key super, I'm gonna go for the Jero because we have a chance to actually kill the Jero this turn with the Fizz Cell super after. And then I'll give these 
to the uh, second form cell. The second form cell doesn't do a ton of damage, but he has some really good defense. Actually, his damage is pretty decent too. If I remember correctly, if we have big bod bat, big bod, <laughs> big bod basses is what I almost said. If we have big bad bosses active, we should be getting like close to three mil attack stat. I think. We'll see. We'll see. Okay, so yeah, good attack numbers for the Fizz Cell, and we kill Jero. That's beautiful. And 2.5 actually for the second form cell. Okay, not bad. Not bad. And not a ton of damage, but that's okay. We still have the Whis active, right? So. It should be fine. I think the friend is rainbow, so I'll put the friend here. Um, and yeah, there's there's no way that the 19 is surviving this rotation. There's just there's no chance. So we should be getting out of here pretty quick. This might actually do some damage just because we don't have a lot of defense right now. Yep, there we go. But uh, it's not going to matter too much. Okay. The normals might kill him, actually. What? We only got one normal additional attack. Interesting. I mean, I know that's possible. It's just rare. It's rare to not at least get, like, two additional normals. Okay, well, anyways. Um, this is going to be a fun rotation, or rather a fun fight because of all those Cell Jr. attacks. Now, um, what we can actually do is get rid of the perfect Cell's attacks, which are the scariest anyways. And if we don't have to worry about his attacks, then this fight becomes a lot more manageable. So yeah, there we go. We're gonna Ghost Usher him specifically with this active skill. And look at that, we just reduced the attacks by at least half. And then, I'm going to pop a Princess Snake, because those attacks at the end still kind of worry me. And uh, let's do the Fizz Cell in the first slot. We're going to do a 15, or rather 17 key super, so it's still going to be attack all. And then, let's try to take out the Tech Cell Jr. And we can probably take out a second one as well. Uh... Should I go for Cell or should I go for a Cell Junior still? Let's go for a Cell Junior. Let's go for like the Fizz one. Okay, there we go. It's funny because Cell is basically gonna destroy himself right now. <laughs> He's gonna <laughs> Cell and Cell Juniors destroying the Cell and Cell Juniors. There we go. Additional super will be great. Damn. Ah oh, man. Yo, an additional super, I think, might have taken out like most of the Cell Juniors. Or actually all of them. Yeah, no, it would have taken out all of them. How perfect would that have been? Okay, so we should kill the Fizz Cell Jr. here. Yep, okay. Good. And let's go for another Princess Snake. Um... Man, the defense is actually not great. I'm kind of concerned if we get supered like twice, that would screw us. So I'm going to go for an aider as well. And that should be okay. Let's put the Fizz Trunks in the first slot. Um, we'll kill one of the Cell Juniors. Okay. Yep, looking good. Looking good. Yes, the RCL Jr. still did 17k with the normal. So a super would have been scary. Oh, additional. Okay, good. But it's going to hit Cell, though, instead of the Cell Jr. Okay. There's a Cell super. But we have Princess Snake and Aider. So 173k. Yeah, okay. So the enemies on this stage hit pretty hard, man. Like, the stage overall is, is pretty tough. Um, compared to some of the more recent ones, I feel like this is definitely the hardest one we've seen in a while. So, I do caution you guys, if you haven't attempted it yet, to be very careful. 
but uh, we should be done with this rather rather soon either way but there were some scary moments man don't get me wrong yo there were there were a few moments where i was like yo i don't know if we're gonna get through this i'm gonna be cautious man i'm gonna go for the Whis. and uh either way this should be it okay no super so i was really concerned about nothing but you know we already made it so far i didn't want to die <laughs> at this point it's always better to be safe than sorry right always better to be safe than sorry and that's gonna do it the double cell combination finishes the job and there you go guys that is the android slash cell saga stage of super battle road at stage 55 um not as easy as i was expecting i really wasn't thinking it was gonna give me give me any issues but um yeah, these guys hit really hard. So proceed with caution in your personal runs. And uh, that's going to do it for today's video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. As always, if you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. Sub to the channel if you're new. Hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And until next time, have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.